Well, hello, my little Google maniacs. Welcome back to Grocery Store Simulator. We are looking here at the next upgrade. 7150. We are almost there. I ground a little bit offline. We're going to do that today. And I may compress a little bit. We're going to try to get 18 as well. But the next one requires 20. So, yeah, not going to happen today because 20 is going to require woo $33,000. We do not have that kind of scratch right now. Eh, we're just about ready for the employees to start showing up for the day shift. I may think about hiring another set of employees. Why aren't they here yet? Hmm, is that them coming over the, coming over the clip there? All right. I uh, may hire another set, and you'll notice I've been stretching some things out here now. All right. Like I said, I was. Each shelf has one product. That's what I like to see. We need some more shelves, and you can tell I bought a few. All right, uh, probably yeah, four... Uh, probably six shelves, yeah. So we're gonna stretch those out today. Maybe uh, put them out to here and really start moving that, these products to one shelf a piece. I've already done a lot of them right here. You can see those ones need split up. This one's good, that one's good, good, good. Uh, this one needs split, that split. Right, so some of them still need splits. We need extra shelves to do that. But down here, I've started to push things out to where they're all one product per shelf, so. Yeah, that's what we're going to do today. We need some more lighting here. Yes. And welcome back, folks. Glad you're here. We are quickly coming to the end of content in this game. I, I don't know what else to do. You know, it happens a lot. Uh, same thing happened over in Pumping Simulator. Uh, yeah, so it's going to happen here, too. We, you know, one more store size in three store levels, I believe. Uh, two store sizes, sorry. But we're going to do one of them today. So let's go ahead. Um, let's go ahead and open up. Make some of that money. Actually, the first thing I'm going to do, besides this... Okay, I ordered about $700 worth of stuff. We're going to stock this. Oh yeah, I wanted to open the store. Boom. Store is open. Yeah, sure is. Yes. And my employees probably getting a little worried that I'm not going to give them a break. We're going to see how far we can push them today. Uh, I've had a problem with one of them quitting before, so... Hopefully they won't get upset and quit. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> Veto. Pushing the limit. You know what? Good for them. Adversity builds character. Smoky barbecue wraps. Hmm, that sounds yummy. So, what's the future of this game? Well, I would hope that they are coming out with some new features soon. Mm, I just don't know at this point. Hopefully, like I said, they come up with something because I am quickly running out of things to do here. As soon as I get these upgrades, um, I'm at the max. So what do you do? And it's just earning money for no reason? Gotta have an end goal, right? Yeah, well... We'll see. They've been good so far. But I'm catching up quick, let's put it that way. Okay, guys, it's time for a break. Where are you? Uh, okay, they're waiting. Hey, good. I didn't have to give them a break today. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna let them stock then. Good. Getting the maximum efficiency out of all my employees. That is the Veto way. And folks, hey, have you heard? Veto started a second channel. They actually started two more channels, but the one that's active right now... Silent Veto. Yeah, what's that all about, you say? Well... Silent Vito, uh, Silent Vito are, um, the same types of videos that you see me doing here, but little to no narration. Yeah, can you imagine that? Vito not talking for an entire 30 minutes. <laughs> I don't think that's ever happened before. <laughs> so yeah, check it out. Um, we have several videos up there already, but I am simultaneously publishing them here on... Wow, that's noisy over there. Simultaneously publishing them here on Beat It a Mutt. Until we get uh, some footing over there, all right? Boom. And, you know, that might take a while. I say that um, it's going to be 10 or 15 videos. It could be much more than that. We'll see how that goes. As of right now, we do have one subscriber over there. As I said in a couple other videos, if you want to subscribe, um, that would be great. Um, for now, you will see them both on both channels. So, you know, I understand the the non necessity to subscribe over there, but soon those will go away off of this channel here, and it will only be on Silent Veto. That's at Silent Veto. Now, I mentioned the third channel, and eh, you heard it. Yeah, the third channel is Retro Veto at Retro Veto. Uh, nothing on there right now, but it will be 
coming soon. And what is that all about? It's retro video gaming. And when I say retro, what do I mean? I mean games, to me, retro, 15 years old or older. All right, so that could mean, you know, mid, mid to almost late 2000s, all the way back to, you know, who knows, maybe I'll play Pong. <laughs> That would be boring, wouldn't it? Yeah. But we'll see. Um, it'll happen soon. Right now I'm focusing on the Silent Veto stuff, and it's starting to go. I've got, uh, I think, three videos up there, and I've got a couple more to post really soon. Right now, the, the big series on there, the only series on there is Car Mechanic Simulator 2021. Again, not a new game, but it's something I'm interested in, and it lends well to the non-narrative style. Uh, and I will tell you that we have some special cars coming up. Got some, uh, got a car at auction, found one in the junkyard. Oh yeah, looking good. And you might recognize them, who knows? Mm -hmm. All right, we're at 63.92. We're about $700 short of our goal of 71.50. These guys and gals have stocked everything pretty well. And they're not doing a bad job. Not doing a bad job at all. Looks like we are running out of some stuff here though. So what I normally do is I pause the action, right? I will close the store, let everybody drain out. I will restock everything. Have them all stock it up out there, right? And then I let the customers loose, and it seems like the money flows in. I ah, know, it's just in my head. But what I'm trying to avoid, and, and this isn't in my head, what I'm trying to avoid is having an empty shelf and a customer doesn't buy something and just walks out. Right, as I mentioned over in Supermarket Simulator, that's lost revenue. You don't want to do that. So I'm going to close the store up, and then I'm going to fast forward. And we will be back right after these messages. No, no commercials. Just a nice little veto dog going, whoop. Okay, I've alleviated my uh, daytime employees. They're now taking a break. You know, while Vito works his little heart out trying to restock everything. It's okay, though. That's your boss, Vito, doing the right thing. So as soon as I open the store, we're going to get to that 7150 really quickly. And then we will get the expansion. And then we will look at uh, doing some other things. Let's see if we can get some more shelving. Okay, break time is over. Get back in here How and stock some shelves. No, they're not. Hey, folks, are you feeling generous? Are you feeling randy? You like what I'm doing here. You don't like what I'm doing here. You're getting mad at what I'm doing. You're getting happy about what I'm doing. Hey, give me a thumbs up. Give me a sub. I would appreciate it. All right, uh, sub numbers are up. Viewership up, sort of. Uh, I'm happy about the sub numbers. The viewership, not, uh, you know, not as high as I would like it. Some videos have not been doing that well. Uh, some have. I'm just trying to find the right combination to, you know, make everybody happy because that's what Vito does. So, in that vein, if there is something that you would like to see me do on the channel that I don't do yet, let me know. Um, yeah, I like to do stuff. I, you know, I'm your puppet. That's how I always say it. But yeah, leave a DM, leave um, leave a comment, and I will gladly try out whatever madness you have in store for Vito. Yeah, I've done it before. I'll do it again. I promise. Blueberry donuts. Hmm. I always miss that aisle because this place is growing so much. <laughs> yeah, we're just about ready to open the store back up. Matter of fact, let's do that so we can get to the 7150 that we need. Store is open. Great to see you too. Yes, it's gonna be a great day. Thank you. What's your name, Sarah? <laughs> Sorry, I don't know everybody's name. <laughs> Nor will I ever. You are just a pair of cogs. That's all you are. Cogs in the veto machine. But I appreciate each and every one of you. <laughs> hey folks, I hope you're checking out the other content on the channel. I always say it, but it bears a repeating. And there are no bears, but it bears repeating salt. So flavor. Uh, why do I have so many of those? Yeah, lots of content out there. Uh, we got some new stuff out there. And if you haven't been watching Star Trekker, it will be making a return here shortly. Another episode soon. The Vedette. Who is me? Driving a semi in space. Could you imagine that? Well, you don't have to imagine it because it's reality. Well, you know, YouTube reality. Yeah, it's just some fun stuff. An interesting title. Nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, nice. And we're gonna have a couple other titles drop here soon. Um, you know, I mentioned it before, just in this video. Trying to fight the right, find the right combination. And the problem is that algorithm doesn't like when I try to find the right combination. You know what I mean? So if I happen to put a new video up and it doesn't do so well, right? They 
they rate me much lower. They show my videos to lo less people. And, you know, that's never a good thing. So what winds up happening is viewership goes down, right? And sub numbers go down as a result. And it's like a vicious circle. Because if viewership goes down, sub numbers go down, then I don't have the chance to get more viewers. You see what I'm saying? And get more subscribers. So it's a delicate balancing act is what I'm getting at. But I'm working on it. Oh, on the back of the head. So I'm being very cautious as to the new titles that I introduce. But I can tell you, there are a couple new ones that I really want to do. So we're going to see how this goes. I bought way too much of that. I don't know what happened there. Hey, how's things going out here, folks? You are not spending enough money. We're only at $6,700. Come on. <laughs> Daddy needs an expansion. Okay, well, I'm just going to have to wait. Be patient. Patience is a virtue. Blah, blah, blah. 68. Getting there, getting there. Come on, let's go, let's go. 69.93, let's go. $156.69. We need it. Let's go, people. Spend, spend, spend. Let's go. Eat that donut. Buy another one. Hey, we're less than $100 away. Okay, break time's over. Kids, go back to work now. Okay. <laughs> Okay, we're just about there. 7126, 7128, let's go. 7148. Mr. Johansson, will you hurry up, please? Okay, 7185, let's do it. Let's get that expansion. Okay, this will get us the store size. If you can believe it, the store's about to get bigger. Okay, you done? <laughs> oh my goodness. This. Unbelievably, is going to make the store bigger. Boom. Oh, yeah. We grew again. Look. Right there, you can see that grew. Oh, yeah, this grew here. Woo! I don't believe this store is bigger now. What am I going to do with all this space? <laughs> Way back there. Right, um, yeah. All right, are you ready? Uh, let's go. Yeah, you got a long walk to that machine now, girl. Uh, we'll move this back here. Okay, let's go see what exactly happened here. Did anything happen? Hello. Oh, yeah, 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 it happened. Oh, my goodness. Wow. What? <laughs> All right, so, uh, you know, uh, this gives me an idea. Offline, I'm going to grind so much. We're going to fill this whole thing with shelves. This place is going to be nuts. We're going to make a million dollars a day. How about that? Does that sound like an idea? I like that plan. Yeah, well, let's uh, at least move some of this stuff back, right? Way back here. I mean, look. Look. Oh, far. Everything is like... <laughs> it's pixelated. It's so far back there. Oh, my goodness. Uh, where did you just pick that from, sir? All right, so uh, let's go ahead and start rearranging some stuff here. We're going to make this a little bit bigger out this way. Yeah, it does look good. Okay. Uh, woo! Yeah. we got a lot of stuff to fill out here, folks. This is truly becoming a hockey rink. I mean, look how big this is. Yeah, everything's blurry down there. It's so far away. It's amazing. What's even more amazing is I can't hear what's going on over here. Like, if I go all the way down here, I can't hear people checking out. <laughs> When someone's asking for help, I I can't hear it. It's amazing. It's so huge now. Uh, this is probably going to get moved down that way. I don't know. It's going to cost a lot of money to outfit all this, but we're going to do it. <laughs> yeah, it's got to happen. Woo! I only got about half of this way, half of this done. And you can see my employees just decided to leave again. All right, so what's next? Um, yeah, next is we need to get those next two... Next two licenses, right? The store levels because that will enable us to get the final store size. So if you can believe it, we're finally almost at the maximum size for the store, right? Store size 10 requires store level 20. Oh, we need three. Yeah, exactly. So 10 grand is the next one. I'm gonna grind a bunch offline. And when I come back, yeah, we will, um, what? Salt, flavor, uh, When I come back, we'll get that, uh, we'll start working on getting the uh, the final store levels, okay? 
So, uh, yeah, so I gotta rearrange some stuff here because uh, I'm not happy. I, I, I like this. I think I did well here. I need to get a couple more shelves there. Mm, I'm not happy with the cooler area. I gotta figure something out about that. I'm gonna put it in rows or something. But it's so wide open here that putting them in rows almost seems like it's closing off that area. I'd like to keep it open like this. Uh, we may do something funky with the shelves. Maybe create like a another corral area with a bunch of shelves on the outside and then some on the inside. We'll see. Uh, I can do some uh, creative things with that. It costs a lot of money though. Uh, so what I'm gonna do, like I said, I'm gonna grind offline, uh, earn a bunch of money, and then keep buying shelves uh, over and over again until we finally fill this place up to get it ready for its final uh, its final destination as a store level 10 or store level 20, store size 10. All right, folks. This has been another wonderful day. Hey, Ready go take a break. I'm here to make things happen. I said go take a break. What do you want? Thank you. Yeah, another another great day. Did a lot of good stuff. Is that grapefruit? It is, yeah. Did a lot of great stuff here today. It uh, doesn't seem like it, but um, yeah, look at the store size. It's huge. It is actually huge. Store size 9. I think that's too big as it is, but we're going to go one more. <laughs> yeah. And then we'll get the licenses and uh, we'll be selling more stuff and yeah. Going to do a lot of rearranging offline. So yeah, folks, stay tuned. Come back soon. Grocery Store Simulator. Yes. As we wrap up content soon, go take a break. Thank you. As always, folks, you stay safe. Woof. You know it! Thank you. Just what I was after. Your wish is my sweet a break! <laughs>